I'm sorry, everyone. This video has been broken into parts. My storage on my my storage is full. If you can imagine that, I have a lot of a lot of things in my mailbox. Um, so I'm gonna have to work on that. But I don't want to have to keep recording over the video again and again. I want to get this posted for all of you. So I apologize. But here is the third part of our video, um, and here's what I learned. People with autism need people around them who are patient and kind. That um, all brains work differently. People with autism may be good at tasks that we find difficult. People with autism have their own ways of helping themselves to remain calm, and that may look different than what we're used to. I learned that being autistic means your brain is wired differently, and sometimes those with autism have a difficult way of explaining what they think or how they feel. So I certainly have learned a lot about autism. I hope you have as well. I'm going to ask you to follow through with Mrs. Uh, one of Mrs. Wexler's ideas. Once you complete your puzzle piece, and you can watch the video again and again to get more facts, I want you to continue to write your facts. Color the puzzle piece with crayon so we can still see the writing. And I wanna ask you to cut out your puzzle piece and ask your family to take a picture of you holding your puzzle piece. I want your family to email that puzzle piece, that picture of you holding that puzzle piece to me, and I'd like to find a way to feature that maybe in one of our Friday letters, on our Twitter page, on our school website. Um, so please, please, please send me those pictures of you holding your puzzle pieces. Also remember, send me those videos if you are saying the um, knocks on pledge and maybe you too will be featured thanks every thanks everybody and we will see you tomorrow have a great day